Understanding the phrase, wells running dry. Hello, everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into an interesting English phrase, wells running dry. This phrase is not just about water and wells, but it holds a deeper meaning in the English language. Stay tuned as we explore its origins, meanings, and how to use it in everyday conversation. Let's start with the literal meaning. A well is a deep hole dug into the ground to access water. When we say a well is running dry, it means the water in the well is depleting. And eventually, there might be no water left. This is a straightforward interpretation, but in English, this phrase is often used metaphorically. In a metaphorical sense, wells running dry is used to describe situations where resources, ideas, or abilities are being exhausted. For example, if a writer is struggling to come up with new ideas, we might say, his creative well is running dry. It's a powerful way to describe a situation where something once abundant is now becoming scarce. To better understand, let's see it in action. Here are a few examples. After years of intense research, the scientists felt their ideas were running dry. The frequent budget cuts have left the community feeling like their funds are running dry. As the discussion went on, it seemed their arguments were running dry. Notice how in each case, the phrase adds a sense of depletion or exhaustion of something valuable. The origins of this phrase are as literal as they get. Historically, communities relied on wells for water. If a well ran dry, it signaled a significant problem, often leading to water shortages. Over time, this real-world concern transformed into a metaphorical expression used in various contexts. And there you have it. The phrase, wells running dry, is a versatile expression in the English language. It's used to convey the depletion of resources, ideas, or abilities in a poetic and impactful way. We hope this video helps you understand and use this phrase confidently in your conversations and writings. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe for more English language learning content.